received today the F1 Slalom Sail. It's the true sail for foiling, for racing, and uh, it's available today. We have it in three sizes. The 9.0 which uses a 520 mast, the 7.7 which uses a 490 mast, and the 6.7 which rigs on a 460 mast. The sail is coming from the concept of uh, the AC1, so our uh, racing sail that we've been using in PW till now. Therefore, the mass lip width is the same as the AC1. It's a construction with three camps, one over the boom, one below the boom, and the bottom of the camber. So exactly like the AC1 as well. We aimed to develop a pure slalom sail, but for the foil. So what are the differences? The differences are not so much in this area, which is exactly what we wanted also for foiling, a deep profile to give power, to keep the stability also of the foil. But the differences are more on the outline, more on the profile, the opening of the leash. So by looking at the base of the sail, the base of the sail is a little bit lower, so that it's easier on a foil stance to actually close the sail, to close the gap on the board by having a lower base. We have right behind there three positions of the clue, because if you're aiming also to use it like more for, let's say, free racing, you can use the higher eyelet, which is the highest position. And then you have two lower eyelets, and those are made for higher wind and for like when you're really pushing into a downwind slalom course. The leech, the central leech of the sail, is a bit more closed. This is because when you keep it open, it's good for going downwind on a slalom uh, board because it gives you also a little bit more backhand power. But closing the leech actually releases that backhand power which is not needed for foiling. So the back leech is more closed compared to the normal sail and the opening of the leash is moved more on the higher part of the sail. The outline is much uh, more narrow, so you have a shorter boom compared to a slalom sail. You have a high aspect ratio therefore, so the whole head is smaller, the whole width of the sail is smaller and uh, let's say that these are the main differences. Regarding the buttons, there's of course uh, a little bit less S-shaping in the sail, while on the slalom sail we have much more S-shaping in the back part of the sail because when you're closing the sail and you're pushing on the fin you want that the sail is opening more. Here the, the, the exit of the sail is a bit more straight, there's no S-shaping in the sail, therefore it's much more stable, let's say, for what you need in the foil. So this is a sail that now is available and uh, we hope that PWA will uh, do some racing this year, so we will see it in action.